Hey everybody, it's Bruce here with Traveling with Bruce. Become a key member of the TWB family by visiting my Redbubble store and ordering your Traveling with Bruce item today. Hey everybody, it's Bruce here with Traveling with Bruce. The Anthem of the Seas is making news today on May the 18th, 2019. She's supposed to be in Bayonne, New Jersey right now, but she is behind schedule. Back on Wednesday, a couple days ago, she was in Labadee, and everything was going beautifully. Everyone had a great time. The ship was supposed to leave Labadee Wednesday the 15th and head back to Bayonne, New Jersey, just outside of New York. The ship was sailing along when all of a sudden, into her second day back, a passenger became very ill, and the doctor on board decided the passenger had to be transferred to a hospital immediately. The officers on board figured out with their charts that the nearest port of call that would work out would be Nassau in the Bahamas. The ship actually had to turn around and head back south to Nassau to transfer the passenger to an ambulance and get this person to a hospital. The ship then turned itself back to New York towards Labadee and has been sailing there ever since. The problem is, though, the ship is now 24 hours behind schedule. So instead of arriving today, the 18th of May, into uh, uh, Bayonne, New Jersey, it's going to be there tomorrow on the 19th of, uh, of May. And this, of course, causes another problem. We have 4,900 passengers on board the ship who are a day late getting back. We have another 4,900 passengers who were supposed to get on this ship today who won't get on this ship now until tomorrow. And so as a compensation to passengers' inconvenience, Royal Caribbean is helping out passengers who are returning to Bayonne with airport cancellation and rebooking fees. They're helping out passengers who are arriving today with uh, booking and also credits. Uh, passengers who decide not to go on this shortened next trip, which will now be a four-day cruise instead of a five-day cruise, will get a full refund. Those who take the cruise will get a two-day credit on the existing cruise plus a future two-day credit on a future cruise. The uh, folks at Royal Caribbean try their best to do it right. The ship will, instead of spending two days in Bermuda on her next cruise, will only spend one and then head her back to Bayonne, New Jersey. Anyway, what are you going to do uh, when there's an emergency? You look after the, pa the passenger and then you figure it out from there. Join me Monday to Friday, 5 o'clock Eastern, Saturdays at 2 Eastern. We talk cruise ships six days a week. I'll keep you posted on this story as it goes forward. And subscribe to this channel today. Hit the bell notification icon. Throw me a thumbs up if you like this video. Thanks for joining me, and we'll talk to you soon, everybody. Bye for now.